Hey investors, Mark Galashevsky here. Japan's stock market has been on a tear over the past year. A sentiment indicator helped us to anticipate the big move up before it happened. Let me show you how we used a negative sentiment extreme in the indicator to make a successful contrarian forecast. The bottom graph on this chart shows a Centix survey of private investors in Japanese stocks regarding their expectations for the economy six months in the future. You can see that it first fell to a negative extreme at the end of the global financial crisis of 2008. It fell to the level a second time during the coronavirus crisis of 2020. And then it fell to the level three more times during 2022, even as the Nikkei 225 index moved sideways in a corrective pattern. That was why the October 2022 issue of our publications said that the recent sentiment extremes supported our bullish outlook for the Nikkei. In the months since then, Japanese stocks have taken off, but in recent weeks, sentiment has flipped to the opposite extreme, as Nikkei 225 index traders have become wildly optimistic. What does that mean for the Nikkei now? You can read the answer to that question in the August 2023 issue of Asian Pacific Financial Forecast or Global Market Perspective.